The curse that held Uma proved hard to lift, but Yennefer and the Witchers managed to do it. The ugliest man alive revealed himself to be not man, but elf, and an elven sage at that. Avalach, for this was his name, was the elven mage who had helped Ciri flee the hunt, then hidden her away on the Isle of Mists.
Firefly stopped at the hut. I'll look inside. Locked. Anybody in there? gonna hurt you. Open up. Oh, you blew a fucking cover. Who are you? What do you want? I'm Geralt, a witcher. Go away! Looking for a young woman. Ashen hair, scar on her face. Will you let me in? No. How many of you are in there? Why do you need to know? You're taking a bloody census! Buy my mum's beer. Get yourselves together, lads. You there! Outside the door! Geralt! That right? Yeah, Geralt. Listen, Geralt. Let's cut to the thick of it. We survived a shipwreck. Recently. Beasts from the depths ate some of my lads. And the rest of us found shelter here. Not too special, that as dangerous litter this isle, but it does go to explain why we're a wee bit distrustful. No way you can get to this isle conventionally. Crikey, you call a shipwreck conventional? Leave it me, mate. You know what he means. <coughs> Let me explain. Short while past, we were on route from Skellig at the Novigrad. And Ferenc got talking with the captain. He sold him a magic firefly purported to know the way to a hidden treasure. This conversation is getting tiring. Listen, let's make a deal. If that's a demon, it will try to dupe us now. I'm not a demon. You don't need to fear me. Give me a chance, I'll prove it. How do you aim to do that? Say I find your mates. Will you believe I mean no harm? Aye, but I'm not counting either. I mean, too easy. How many are there? Three. Ivo, Gaspar, and Benny. This Ivo. Where do I look? Edget insisted he'd explore the caves to the east. Tried to knock it out his head. Literally. Bugger wouldn't budge. Gaspard. Well, I find him. He said it was defeatist, said the late to be rescued. We had to take action, or at least, he did. Claimed to have spotted a lantern out to sea, so he said he'd climb the highest peak to look out for a ship. Where'd Ferenc go? West, in search of a ship that's said to be out there. Ferenc, he's there. Uh, handy. Thought I might fix it up. Make me see what they... All right. See if I can't find all three. See ya. I'm content to understand. Show me what you got.
nice to see you. I talked to your friends. Come down. Right. I'm coming. You lucky devil, you. You know, I've one regret that. Oh, ah, ah! Dead. Damn. Hey, wake up. Shoo. Back to bed, Nibbles. Wake up. What? What's happening? Who, who are you? I'm Geralt. You and your friends. What's your story? Rabinick and Company. Real estate appraisal, insurance, mass event organization. <sighs> Gaspard Sutter. My mates call me sleepy. I even slept through that storm. <laughs> it's a shame so many died. Any chance you've seen an ashen-haired woman around here? Here? Nay, not a soul. But ooh, a lot passes me by on account of my sleeping. Your friends asked me to find you, Ferenc, and Ivo. I'm afeard they're dead. Some horror swarmed Ivo saw it with my own eyes. And Ferenc, I heard him. A blood-curdling cry, then the roar of a beast. Let's get back to the hut. I'll protect you along the way. Shame about the lads, really, but what can you do? Come on. But I should warn you, I suffer from narcolepsy, meaning... <gasps> I know what it means. Don't worry, I'll keep you awake. <sighs> Off we go then.
left enough. I've seen... Wake up. Know much about this isle? Almost nothing. Stronger than me, and so. Wake up. All right, right. Just a wee bit longer. Stronger than me, I'm so sorry. Wake up. Uh, I'm awake. Why wide, wide awake? Come on, keep moving.
to flee the She's a naughty kitty, aren't you? <laughs> All right, I'm up. So, what is it brought you to this strange place? Looking for someone. friend. Ah, sure. Let's hear him then. Wake up. D I'm awake. Ha <laughs> ha! Gaspard! Stand back! I'm opening the door! Gaspard! Ha! You seem a bit muddled. Uh, muddled. A bit drowsy, that's all. What of the others? Found one near a monster's den. He was already dead, sadly. Saw another fall from a cliff. Broke his neck. Shit! Raverick told me to have an eye on the snot. Twas his nephew. Thanks for helping, and, uh, sorry I didn't trust you. Oh, everything's gone wrong. What'll we do now? Got a boat. You can leave with me, but I need to find someone first. An ashen-haired lass? Yes. Oh, dreadful, sorry. What do you mean? She's cold. Spirits left her. Must have passed shortly before we found her. Let's wait by the boat.
Guess not all of Vesemir's teachings have receded into oblivion. A Witcher can forget to eat, to drink, to breathe even. But a Witcher never, ever forgets to care for his blade. <laughs> ah, yeah, I used to repeat that incessantly. Never tired of doing it either. What creature was it? Huh? Creature? One that gave you the scar over your left eye. It's new. I don't remember it. Souvenir from the Cockatrice of Spala. Another addition to the collection. Nothing special. Yours is healed beautifully, though. Avalach. He prepared some special ointments for me. But that was before the curse gripped him. I wonder where he is now. Waiting at Kaer Morhen with the others. You lifted the curse? Yeah. Tell you on the way. Got a boat on the beach. Once we land, we'll head for Kaer Morhen. On a horseback. Right. Conventional means of travel. They're just better. Though a portal would be quicker. And draw Eredin to us immediately. Rather not risk it. Besides, I hate portals. Damn! Listen, we gotta think of a way to... Welcome back, child. Siri! My, you've grown beautiful. No point standing around. Come on, time to greet the others. You've not changed a bit. Any of you. Just like I remembered. What? Little sis. Here, everyone you asked for help. Avalox resting in the tower, still in pretty bad shape. No reason to do it out here. 
Come inside. Damn, it's good to see you again. I... Maybe I'll give you two a moment. Trist, please. No, no, y you must have missed each other terribly. A minute's delay won't hurt anyone. Fine. So, a minute, then we go, all right? This is just a little awkward. 45 seconds. Huh? We've 45 seconds left. Well, 30 now. And then we throw the gauntlet at the Wild Hunt. So I beg you, use these seconds well. Yen, I adore you. Hmm. No points for creativity. But for your candor... Time to go. Navigators open portals, rifts that we might counter with dimeritium or our own magic. They also summon the frost that occupies the voids through which they travel. Good to see There's you. just not enough of us. It'll be hard. Hunt will be here soon. Head. Ah, Geralt! How are things? Farewell, on crate. Ha! You found her. Bring all your tools with you? Thought to myself, a battle approaches. Blades will need honing. Plate will need some hammering. That sort of thing. Thought right. Thanks, Sultan. Plan to top that by brewing some more Mahakam and Mix. Shade so volatile, you need but glance at it to set it off like a flaming fart. Very useful during sieges. Willing to craft something for me? Of course. Provided you've a diagram. Zoltan. I certainly hope this gas will work. Wolf. It shall. We must just ignite it at the right moment. And that hole, is that there for good? We shall worry about the hole once it is all. Step back, Master Witcher. She's one of us, Geralt. No way we'll let him take her. Damn piece of junk. Barely younger than Vesemir. Any progress? Just can't get this thing to fling a bolt. They'll sooner appoint me Hierarch of Novigrad. Eskel. Greetings, Wolf.
to see you. Huh. Set out alone, Vest tracked me down, insisted on coming. I ought to give you a hiding for not asking my help, but I took it all out in Roach along the way. Ah, some old friends. What's this horse son doing here? We need him. You might have forgotten what he did. I haven't. Gotta save Ciri, whatever the cost. And Letho's faced the hunt before. I don't question his abilities. I simply don't trust him. Letho won't betray us. <laughs> You're naive. Always have been. Usually I don't give a shit, but this time it could kill Vess and me both. Think this through before it's too late. We'll stay and help. But we don't want him at our backs. Roach. No desire to talk to you right now, Geralt. Vess. Yes? Don't be mad. Poor judgment bringing the Kingslayer here. Big fight ahead of us. How's morale? Remember our encounter with them at the Hanged Man's Tree? We'll thrash him again this time. Greetings, Geralt. If I'm to die today, I wish to look... Leave my dresser alone. Getting all gussied up for the wild hunt? Women only ever beautify themselves for their own satisfaction. Glad you're here. It's good to see you again. Expected you earlier. I started off heading in the opposite direction, but then turned around. What made you change your mind? There are times when a woman should simply not explain her decision. That goes doubly for sorceresses. How are you? Care more into your liking? More so than Velen, but that's hardly an achievement. How was your trip? Get here all right? <sighs> Get everybody together. Time to talk. Thank you for coming. The Wild Hunt will be here soon. They're coming for Ciri. Want to take her? We'll stop them. How do you even know the hunt will show? They always know where I teleport to. And they move from place to place in an instant. So what's our plan? There aren't many of us, but I'd trust any of you with my life. Work together and we'll defeat the hunt. When they attack, Yen will dome the fortress with a magic shield, and will be forced to land outside the walls. If they're dispersed out in the woods, we could hunt down small groups of riders. Got our first volunteer for the hunting party. I'm the second. Count me in, too. 
Always believed attack is the best defense. The hunt will try to penetrate into the fortress through navigator portals. I can do nothing against this kind of magic, so you'll need to find and close as many as you can while hunting in the woods. Lambert will make us die meridian bombs. Remember the formula? Of course. Excellent. Erden should work on the portals as well. I shall also give you each an amulet. Snap them in half and you'll become invisible, at least while you remain still or move slowly. Move abruptly, engage any foes, clash with them, and they will see you. Apart from that, they will be able to hear you and smell you. If you come across a large unit, do not attack. Signal Triss and she will provide support. I'll look for your signal. Soon as I see it, I'll rain fire on the forest. Ciri's most important in all of this. The hunt's after her, and we have to defend her at all costs. What do I do? Stay inside the keep. If they break through, come inside. We'll all converge to help you. Out of the question. I can look after myself. No one doubts that, child. But remember the most important moment when hunting a monster? <sighs> Wait for an opportunity. After the council, I'll give you an amulet. If you use it, a ball of fire will land where you're standing, just in case. Remember, there's only a few of us. We have to help each other, work together. If anything goes wrong and the hunt puts us on the defensive, we pull back, make a stand at the gates of the fortress. The inner courtyard is our last line of defense. If we don't stop them there, we're doomed. What else do we have that we can use? Since you plan to ambush the hunt in the woods, I could dig some trapping pits, blue stripe style. Meaning? Deep as the dark abyss, bottoms bristling with sharpened stakes. I brought this Mahakaman mix. Flammable as bone dry saltpeter and plowing sticks to everything. We fill some barrels, stack them in a narrow passage, and fire them up at an opportune moment. You know we stand on a vast deposit of gas. If need be, I could open cracks in the earth, create explosions. I would need to prepare, though. There's a laboratory and the workshop. One thing to remember, we've got limited resources and even less time. We ought to decide what kind of weaponry will be most useful against the hunt. Absolutely. We need to assign one type of weaponry each to the lab and workshop. Anyone have any ideas for the workshop? Been wanting to fix that breach in the wall, but we'll need the same tools to clear the rubble from the armory. Rubble? Haven't you heard? Roof caved in a couple of years back. There's some excellent swords in there. Swords we could use. Filling in the breach seems just as important. They come through there, the siege will be over awfully quick. Fixing the breach in the walls a priority. Let's not forget the laboratory. I started brewing some potions. Like to finish, if you don't mind. I could prepare more of those witcher's traps, but I'd need all the lab equipment. There aren't many of us, so we'll need to prepare as many traps as possible. We won't have time to do much else. Everything settled? Yes, settled. We don't have much time, so let's get to work. Let's sum up. Yennefer will create a magic barrier to repel the main assault. That should push the opposing force into the woods where Lambert, Geralt, and Letho will be waiting. They'll use Dimeridium to close the Navigator's portals, stop as many warriors as possible from entering the fortress. Triss will be waiting for their signal, then give the riders hell. 
All others will repel any foes who make it inside the fortress walls. If anything goes wrong, we abandon the outer courtyard, pull back to the keep. Remember, Aridan can't get his hands on Ciri. That's most important. Let's look at the map of the fortress, figure out the details. Can't help feeling we've overlooked something important. Don't think about it. What's ready? Haven't had much time to prepare, so not much, honestly. I'm exposing you all to danger, unnecessarily. You worry too much. Wipe that frown off your face, we'll make it. Thanks. For everything. I'll saddle the horses. Come once you're ready to head into the woods. Taking Letho with us. You know my opinion.
starting. Woods, now. Gonna have to thank Yen once this is all over. That spell, really something. And the invisibility. Hounds could sniff you out, so don't get too close. And you'll be visible as soon as you start fighting. Remember that. He always talked this much. Only when he's nervous. Good work with these bombs, by the way. Aim at the portals. Be precise. I'm out of Dimeridium. Yen mentioned casting the Urden at the rifts. Said the sign could seal them. They're here. Time to say hello. Slow down. Element of surprise is key. Stay hidden. Give Triss a chance to show them what she can do. Then we'll hit him. Mean to say Marigold can conjure up more than a cloud of butterflies. Lots more. Wait and see. Next time you get the feeling I'm about to piss off Marigold? Make sure you knock me upside the head. Love these moments. The air before a battle. Nothing smells as sweet.
Roach's pits. Couldn't have asked for that. What now? Coming visible. We're gonna try to kill him. Too risky. Pansy. What's with Marigold? Shit. You were meant to wait inside! I cannot hide forever! I must face them! Back inside now! No! Geralt gave the signal from the woods and Triss hasn't cast the spell! Damn it! All right, run to her!
waiting. A blizzard's almost at the fortress. Faster, Roach. Don't stop! Marigold will shield us! Wonder if it took him out. Imlareth? Doubt it. Detachment approaching from the woods. We need to close the gate before they get inside. Giving me no choice. Chris to worry about now.
Things were looking shaky. We had to fall back. They tried to get in through the main gate. I'm afraid they could succeed next time. What's with Esco? We have to retreat. He's in trouble. I'm going to help him. Remember the stone I gave you. Retreat beyond it! Fall back! You're not supposed to be out here. Too late now. They're coming in through the gaps! Time Iridium bombs. You'll find more in the crates by the walls.
abandon you. You humans are so impractical. Siri, no! You always were an unruly child. I adored that about you. Now fly! I... I was too late to help him. It's not your fault.
I should not have fled here to Kermorin. Avalark is weak, but alive. Triss is tending to the others. I nearly killed you. Killed everyone. We'd all be dead if not for you. No, Geralt. The hunt would never have come to Kaer Morhen if I wasn't here. Bezimir's funeral. We should prepare. Yourself. No witcher's ever died in his own bed. You don't know how it is to see someone you love die because of you, for you. We all knew what we were signing up for. Yes, and you saved me. For how long? A week? A month? We'll hide you, cover your tracks. No. I will flee no more. Va fail. For those who remain, death should never take precedence over life. Pay your last respects to your friend. Then we must hold counsel.
What's on your mind? Care Morin. Can't imagine this place without Vesemir. I'll head down the valley soon, then find somewhere else to winter next year. Come on, it's the only home we've ever had. Stay. No, Geralt. Place has been dying a while. Last nail in the coffin today. Time we accepted that. Thank you. <laughs> Please. She was my ward, too. And the old should only ever stick around to help the young. You know, this hardly ends your struggle. I know. Whatever you aim to do now, remember you'll find souls willing to aid you in Skellige. Myself, Krach, his children. Don't really know what I'll do next. When doubts plague your mind, follow your instincts. Should they steer you wrong and land you in muck, you'll land at peace with yourself. And that's most important. Good advice. Bah, of course it is. I'm a hero fan, aren't I? I must pick a course for home soon. Take care of yourself, and Siri. Thanks again for everything. I regret I did not know him better. That was tough. We managed. Thanks for helping. You're welcome. Would you consider staying at Kaer Morhen? It'd be nice. At least for a while, till I figure out what's next. Agreed. Do it. No reason to come back here. So? Tell me. I can say I've seen it all now. I still don't believe everything that happened. Risked your lives for me. How can I repay you? We'll think of something, right? Definitely. What will you do? We're bound for Novigrad. To fight the next fight. If you miss us, look for us at the camp. There you are. Crying shame about Vesemir. I'm sorry. Thanks for your help. I had a debt to pay. Heading straight back to Skellige? Wouldn't be right to tarry. War with the Black Ones won't wait. You can count on me, you know. Always. I know. Thanks. Thanks for everything you did for me and Siri. May I be honest? Had I known what would happen here, I'd never have come anywhere near Kaer Morhen. I'm glad I could help, but I shall leave as soon as Lambert feels better. You going together? I've an idea, but I need a Witcher to help me see it through. Lambert has agreed to assist me. Hmm. <laughs> Good luck, and thanks again. We're even now. Can we talk? What about? Try not to get into any arguments, can you? They've all come here to help. Are you gonna tell me how to behave now? No. Just asking you nicely. Well, how's this for a nice answer? Kiss my ass. Sheesh. Holding up all right? I love questions like that. Am I holding up? What? My dick? This is shit, Geralt, and you know it. I knew the old man couldn't live forever. Even told Eskel that when it came time, I'd get his sword. Fits my hand perfectly, you know? But... Vesemir deserved a better death. Whereas he died like a louse. Crushed. We'll avenge him. Doesn't look that rosy to me.
See you later. Yeah, take care. Come to see how I'm feeling. Thanks. Not bad. That's good. Ah, son. Horrible about Vesemir. I know you were close. Thanks. We were. Listen, far be it from me to stick my beard but it'll no scratch an itch. So don't take this the wrong way. I want to help, whatever you decide, but to my mind, we've got to counterattack. We've got to find the hunt, Eredin, and charge at them both like a bull at a heifer. Not that simple, unfortunately. We have no way of finding them. They find us easily. Can take us by surprise whenever they want. Forgive me, Geralt, but that's the blathering of a man who clearly can't snap out of it after a tragic loss. Drink it off. Sleep it off, whatever it takes. Just get yourself together and think things through. I'll do that, Sultan. teachings always, and the sacrifice you made. Zirel can harness immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly, to no effect. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Zirel from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses. Arch mistresses of magic. You mean the Lodge? Many of the Lodge's members are dead. The rest are in hiding. Philippa Eilhart, Margarita Loantil, and Fringilla Vigo are likely still alive. And Francesca and Ida? Think they'd agree? I think they'll take convincing. Would you rather speak to Kira alone? That would probably be best. Don't trust the Lodge one bit, but doesn't seem like we have a choice. Because we don't. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think! I've had enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Jirel possesses a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly, and not through Geralt. I'm gone. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn.
Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. Don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. <sighs> we shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet, either. Geralt, please, not now. <sighs> By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalar says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Tell me, how do you do it? What? Always manage to pull yourself together. Focus. No matter what's happening. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? The Skellica druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! You'll regret that. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> Win. We'll see about that. Right. That really works. Thanks. Glad to be of service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. Saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. 
And guess who's the guest of honor? Don't know. Enlighten me. Imlerith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where'd you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlerith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. Why do I doubt Avalak's a fan of this idea? Do you see him here? I left him a letter. We'll rejoin him in Novigrad. Come. We shall talk on the way. Lead on. Ready? Let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri, who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. The men at Crow's Perch, they spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the Ladies of the Wood. The peasants feared coming here, and the Baron thought the Ladies of the Wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the Baron is. He found his wife, took her away somewhere far. Anna, she was unwell. A true shame. We stand to find Imlarith here? You sure? Avalok told me of beings who commune with the NL Elves. They can be found in every part of our world. In Velen, the Crones do this. Apparently, Imlarith came here at Eredin's behest, to order the Crones to keep their eyes open and ears pricked, in case Avalok were to seek shelter in his Velen hideout. Took the order literally judging by all the ears hanging in the woods. Think Imlarith might still be here? He craves the pleasures of the flesh, wine, sex. The crones indulge him, flatter his ego. I'm certain he'd not let this opportunity pass, and will be on Bull Mountain for the Sabbath. You actually know this area? Centuries ago, it was a hallowed site for druids. But then the crones arrived, destroyed the Velen Circle, and deformed the sacred oak atop the mountain. An important feast is observed here annually. The Sabbath, they call it. All the local folk attend. I suspect Imlarith attends too, as the Crone's guest. Seem to know it well. Avalark's a good tutor. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. The peasant folk of Velen call this night... ...for gifts. I've no Loads idea of why. footprints. A crowd of peasants came through here. Avalok claims vanity is Imlar's greatest weakness. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthia, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalok's student.
Should I shoot? The white one once served the ladies. But he... Let them approach. But they've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. But we've fires down that away, with food and drink aplenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. We thank you for the invitation. Be glad to sit down, right? Speak for yourself. Come with me. Ladies of the wood visit you? If they favor us. My father told me they descended once. Passed from fire to fire, listening to hopes and grievances. So each year, we wait for them to walk amongst us once more. Haven't done it in a long time then. No point waiting to see if we'll get lucky. Yeah, we gotta try to reach the peak. Mentioned a gate. Said we wouldn't pass. Only the Chosen visit the ladies. Every year, young lads and lasses climb the mount, but never more than three. Let me guess. The young lads and lasses don't return. No, they return happy and radiant. But rare is the one who then stays in Velen. Off they go to seek fortune in the wider world. This celebration, what's it about? What do you need to know, Wanderer? No need for anger. The White Ones serve the ladies as we do now. We send them gifts all year long. And on this night, they repay us with their blessing. I met one of your gifts to the crones. Snivelly. Scared to death and about eight years old. Stay calm. Your children. Why do the ladies need them? We know not and never ask. You don't know? Then let me tell you. Tell us instead what a peasant, his own young and starving, is to do with a wandering war orphan. You're not from here. Don't judge us by others' laws. Said the ladies bestow blessings on you. Aye, for our lives turn thus. First a summer of labor beneath the hot sun, then autumn rains, then a winter of death. Then we await spring, when all that is dead is born anew. And from our blood and sweat, the oak bears acorns, at times few, at times a handful. What do you do with the acorns? The Velen elders gather, hold council, some favor grinding them to spread on the fields for a rich harvest. Others want them given to a cunning woman who'd make medicine for consumption. A handful of enchanted acorns is enough for all venom. Tis never enough. Heard enough about this. We've got other questions. We should be going. Eager to see the ladies, I share your yearning. We're afire with yearning. Come, Geralt, we must get there before daybreak. Go to the tent and stand before Thecla. She's the one who decides who's worthy to face the ladies. I'm more ready. That's him. Prepare for it. For it too prepares for you. Drive it not off already. with bold words. Yeah? Let me see what you're offering.
So long. My grandmother said I came down the moat just before daybreak. How did they look? At once beauty and horror. Like an army. Good of ladies. Merciful ladies. My grandson, give him out. He works his share of mischief. Look, a child. No, a godling. I know him. Name's Johnny. Well, old B, you're back. Uh, and I see you found your lass. I'm Johnny. We've had the pleasure already. A bit one-sided, though, it was. See, I saw you running. You're back to me. As I was <laughs> having the pleasure of... Oh, tis a long story. They call me Siri. Nice to meet you. How are things, Johnny? Health's good, so no complaints. What brings you here? What are you doing here? Last we met you and the crones weren't exactly friends. I got an invitation I couldn't refuse. Same as every year. In their peculiar way, the crones tolerate my presence and wish to see me at their Sabbath. So I come, wander about, and go home with the rising sun. What about you? We gotta climb a mountain. Can you help? I'd rather try to dissuade you, but I'm certain that would be in vain. The lass, she is stubborn as you. Even more so. Figured as much. Oh. Path to the peak starts there, past the gate. But only old Thekla's got the key, so since you shan't ever get it, you best turn back now. The key. Why do you doubt we can get it? Good grief! You're worse than children! Three souls are allowed atop the mountain, and only strapping young lads or comely lasses among them. They get the key, open the gate, and meet the ladies. I believe I qualify. But he's old and ugly. What good is he? Pretty damn good at finding lost voices. Then go find the voice of reason. It'll tell you to turn back. There's no fooling with the ladies. We're here to find an elf named Imlarith. Siri thinks he might be a guest of the crones. Big bloke, in full plate? Going the right way. He's atop the mountain, all right. You've seen him? Saw him in the bog first. Water froze beneath his horse's hooves. Then I saw him again yesterday, heading up this path. Why are you looking for him? He killed my friend. Wouldn't seek revenge if I were you. Even the ladies bow and scrape before that one. Gotta get to the summit. Simple as that. It's Thecla you'll need to convince. She's blind as your bum, but she won't be fooled. We shan't try to trick her. She sits in that tent over yonder. I wish you luck, and do hope we meet again, someday. Moons are rising, owls hoot, fires just a gleam. Hours lay in slumber, cozy. Close your eyes. <laughs> One night we get to fill our bellies to the brim. None of them. Closer, girl. Aye. What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. Never mind. Got me answer. I choose you, girl. This night you shall see the ladies.
Siri. Wonderful. Who wouldn't want to meet the ladies? My companion comes with me. <laughs> what else has the cat dragged in? It's grey and veiny, got a scar, and eyes like a viper. Aye. Stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus it's old and infertile. I reject ye, freak. The girl will ascend alone. What's this about? What have you chosen her for? Tell him. Each year, three chosen have the honor to meet the ladies. What happens after they've had this honor? When they return, they speak of the past no more. Joy rules them and they start life anew. The lass were not the first to be chosen this day, but the moon hangs eyes, so she's like to be the last. I'm going with her. <laughs> He's fire in his gut. What do you see? He's determined. He loves the girl, but he seeks to hide it from us. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. By ancient right you may appeal my choice. But to do so, you must best the challenge. What kind of challenge? Tell him. You must descend into the cave and bathe in the waters below the earth. What's the catch? The water's deep. The water's murky. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse, so they call it the Defiers Oran. Now, bring me the coin. Something's nigh.
I was beginning to worry. Come, let's get the key. Something's afoot. They're back. What do you want? Can't help but be curious. What's at the summit? Tell him. The ladies dwell there. But only the Chosen may look upon them. I know that. I want... You'll learn nothing else here. Got that coin you tossed in the lake. It reeks of sludge. Nothing I can do about that. So, gonna keep your word? I always do, my boy. Show the coin to the gatekeeper past the threshold. He'll know its meaning. Marika will open the gate for you. Now go! That went smoothly. Weren't the one to do the diving in that cave. Stop whining. You're a witcher. You've dived in murkier waters. Yeah, I have to tell you about the time I hunted a zubo. Let the first divertis begin. And let them last till the crack of dawn. Something's afoot. Something's nigh. If only their gifts are plentiful. Ah! That's it. What's your name, girl? What's yours? <clears throat> your name don't matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? I passed the trial. Here's proof. Recognize it? The Defiers, Oren. A death sentence. No time to lose. I'll tend to Imlarith, you take the crones. Avalark said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlarith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. Damn it! Two out of three! Out of the question. I'll climb the mountain, you face the crones. Hardly a challenge. They're extremely dangerous. Be careful. You too. Let's get down there. Oh, hell. I guess I must jump.
how was he? He lived a life of love and knew no bitterness. Return. Your taste lingers on our tongues. You've talked enough. No, it's ours. You're not being Let's get down there. Oh, hell. I guess I must jump. You've talked enough. You've died tonight. 
Summit. Gotta be. Humming. Piece of power. Let's go.
sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl. But she is with you, is she not? Yeah, we're both here. Where is the girl? Doesn't matter. You'll never get her. You fall to the bitter end. I trust this time will be no different. A fight like this. The Witcher you slew. We did it. Barely. How'd it go down there? We slew only two of the crones. The third fled with Vesemir's medallion. My sole memento.
coming here? Good idea. I knew we'd succeed. From the start. Now to find Eridin and kill him. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses at the lodge. We ought to rejoin them. Give me a minute. I'm old. Need more rest. Hmm. You are, and you do. Let's stay a bit longer. So, off to Novigrad then? Yeah, let's get going. Let's go. The Oak is dead. The Oak, the Crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns? Got one. Take it. But one? What will we do now? This is no longer no man's land. It's no longer the lady's land. It's all yours. What are we to do? Come, Geralt. It's time. Manage on your own. Humans. Thought it was mages the hunters and the temple guard were after. Mages left. Hunters needed a new quarry. Hatred and prejudice will never be eradicated, and witch hunts will never be about witches. To have a scapegoat, that's the key. Humans always fear the alien. The odd. Once the mages had left Novigrad, folk turned their anger against the other races. And as they have for ages. 
branded their neighbors their greatest foes. Geralt had found you. Glad to see you in one piece too, Dandelion. Where have you two been? Went to care more in first, then Valen. Leave him alone, Zoltan. Can't you see their beat? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Gladly take some. Me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, girls. With a little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up and await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. Anything happened while we were away? Pretty Polly came down with a fever, that oyster caught a knife between the ribs, and they're late delivering the sodden triple meat. Dandelion. Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs, waiting for you. Yennefer's gone to crippled Kate's. Yen? At that portside dive? Why? Didn't inform me. Imagine that. Ah, and that elf of yours moved into the ruby suite told me to tell you he's waiting, too. Gave him your best room? He didn't exactly ask. I prepared another room for him, but he blew past me and locked himself in the ruby. Hasn't peed out since. Barely eats, drinks only water, and the only thing I've heard from him is, I wish to know when Gwynblade and Zeriel arrive. Thanks. Looks like I'll have my hands full. 